Hi guys, this is Angel from PRDB Entertainment and this tutorial I will teach you guys how you can add a timer or play with time with seconds around or for you different events that you may have on you may add on your project on your scene on your game. On um, this tutorial I'll just use the timer so we can add like uh, an amount of percent for the energy bar like every three seconds or five seconds or so I think every three seconds will add like one percent only so okay so let's start with this first of all we're going to work on the level blueprint let's go to blueprint on the top open level blueprint i'm going to change this to my other screen there we go okay so here we're going to create a custom event first okay i'm going to put here fill energy and let's add uh an event begin play yeah because it has to be done every time you begin the game okay so on this one on the fill energy this cast it this cast this to our third person character because we want to get the variables of this character blueprint that we have get uh, player character okay now let's get our variables let's get energy we need to put another one it's going to be set energy because we need to tell them the new amount of even of energy he's going to have and let's say that's going to be float plus float here it is so he's going to be adding only yeah, 1%. 1% every 3 seconds. Okay? So I'm going to connect this here. And the total is going to be set for the energy bar. And let's set the timer. Set timer event. There we go. Now, this function is the one that's going to be counting the seconds. So let's put it on 3 seconds. Let's say that's going to be a loop around going around always let's connect it with the begin play so every time the game starts it starts uh, running the seconds okay so we got three seconds every time uh, game starts he will count three seconds always and he will cast the character so he will get the variables he will uh, add the plus one to whatever total amount of energy he has and he will set that amount for the energy bar okay so let's try it out let me close this here and let me go back to my screen and as you can see the energy bar is filling up every three seconds that it passes now this will be uh, will be good for a survival game like a uh, open world game that you may be trying to find food, uh, water, stuff like that around the, the world, around the map. You can do it maybe for the energy, the stamina, the health. Uh, well, you can use the timer for other things too, like maybe flashing lights or something when you step on something, or maybe a door that starts opening if you step on a button or something. And if you step off, it starts to close, uh, depending on the seconds, how much the animation is going to run. Uh, you can do a lot of stuff with the timers. Well, guys, uh, I think it's enough, at least for this tutorial. This is Angel from PRGB Entertainment. Hope to see you guys on the next tutorial. If you have any questions, just comment on the comments on the box below. And don't forget to hit the like or the dislike button. Bye.